Hey everyone, in this lecture we're gonna talk about uh, Format Painter, that is uh, the only topic left under Clipboard Controls on Home tab. So if you want to uh, uh, learn about uh, other options under Clipboard Control, uh, I suggest you to watch our previous two tutorials which were based on all these th things. So Format Painter, uh, as you see that here I have to uh, cells where uh, I have written different uh, X and I've tried to uh, mention the uh, exact properties of that uh, particular cell. For example, in this cell which is A6, we have normal text. There is no formatting. I uh, will be uh, covering this formatting part later. I just want to show you what Format Painter uh, uh, can do. So it is a normal text with font Arial, register style. And then its size is 18. I can increase or decrease the size from here. So the second one is having a red color uh, text color and it is a bold text and its size is 15. Third one is having underline and italic and blue background and white foreground color. Similarly, in this cell, we have normal text which is of size 16 without any bold, italic, or underline. But here I increase the row size to let's say specific uh, uh, size and, and the column width also and uh, here uh, I have merged three cells so let's see what all Format Painter covers and what all things it does not so Format Painter basically formats uh, it basically copies the format of one cell and applies that format to some other cells for example if I have a text written here this is my test uh, sample now I make a copy of it let's say 10 different copies of it so I want to apply the same format uh, which is on A6 I'm going to apply this format on this cell which is T6 so instead of uh, changing all the properties manually I can simply go to this cell I can click on Format Painter. Now, once I click on it, you will see that that cell is blinking. That means that format is copied, and wherever I drop this, now it will be pasted over there. So that format is copied and pasted over here. This is not text copy like we did before. This is not value or formula copy. This is just format copy and paste. So we are just pasting the format, nothing else. Text remains as it is. Similarly, if I want to let's say copy this format, I can apply it here. So if I copy this thing, I can apply it to this. Oh, my bad. So let's do it again on this cell. Now you must be wondering uh, that why these two cells are not alike. The reason uh, is coming in the next example. Uh, let's say I do format copy and paste here uh, on this cell. So you see that it is not uh, uh, it is not increasing row height and width according to what uh, the actual cell is having. So basically, it only copies uh, the properties like font font size bold italic underline, border color and background and foreground colors, merging and uh, these alignments and indentations but it does not uh, cover uh, cell dimensions so it won't be I mean increasing or decreasing size according to uh, the original cell so if you want to uh, do that you need to do, do it manually so this is what it covers and similarly if I talk about merge cell now if I copy something from a merge cell and, and if I try to paste it over a simple cell it will you will see that your data which was there in cells D13 uh, and D14 was overridden by the text which was in D12 it simply copied that format it was uh, the original cell was having three cells here merged so the destination cells were also merged starting from that cell and uh, 
moving from that cell uh, two cells downward so it covered three cells it merged them and the data from the other two cells were lost now it only uh, keeps the data for first cell and tries to show you that format so this is all about format painter so be careful while you are applying format painter so it does not cover cell dimensions and it uh, also covers uh, merging so be careful while applying uh, while copying format from a merge cell rest uh, uh, font and all those these things these are simple to copy so you can use anywhere where you want to simply uh, keep that format thank you for watching this video uh, in the next video we'll be covering uh, font and alignment things goodbye